Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of React Native. So today we are going to create a nice drop down. You can see that we have a drop down button, right? So let me create a build again. I guess this is ha uh, stuck over here. So I need to run this one npx react native android run. So it will automatically start and run. So we will learn this documentation first. I am using, you can see that this, these are beautiful, nice Android picker, iOS, picker iOS. Okay. And they have maximized downloads it, of it, right? Weekly downloads. So we can use this drop down React Native picker, right? And uh, I have already used this one part. You can see that over here. So we have nicely built in like this one, grapes, apple. You can select this one, right? And how to make this one? Let's look at the code level, right? So here I have just, this is the default imports. You know that. Then I'm using React Native picker picker, right part? Okay, then we have initialized the part, selected category. Uh, this uh, this is not in use, okay? And we have a list of like, you know, states of that, which we have defined all the categories we have. Then on value change, we have defined. Whenever we click on the on value change, then we are bind this one, it will go this one, whatever value we have. We have select this in the select category state, right? Whatever the value we have, okay? And this is the UI part, the picker. This is the picker part. You can see that here we have the picker. Then we have a selected value, on change value, okay? And the picker dot item where we have the list of items, right? So here, here you can see that I have just stated the category map. And in the picker dot item, we have the color. You can change the color. You have a label. We have the value, right? You can change the label, you can change the value according and what is the index, okay? So I have, we have passed the index also, right? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so this is a picker item, the same thing, that is a picker item, right? And uh, we have already done this one, this part. After doing this part, the uh, this will come up, right? So you can select the values, you can get the values accordingly and send whatever value in the backend part or in the form or whatever. So you can select it like this. So I hope you understand what exactly we have made with this uh, react native picker so any query any issue in that let me know in the comment section don't forget to like share and comment on my video and of course subscribe my channel please have a great day